Hey everybody, I'm Zach. This is Schmirk and and welcome back to Earthbound. Is a reprint of custom card. That's exactly right, Fusion Bolt. That is exactly right. Um, Schmur opened the present, and there's a great charm. I'm gonna give the great charm to Derp because I think it gives extra defense. It does. It's not much, but she needs it big time. All right. So we're in the Lilliput steps. We just walk in. I forgot to click record before I walked in. I'm sorry about that. Um, we haven't done anything except for find that great charm and level up Derp a little bit. Her name is Derp because I am Schmirkadubber and my girlfriend's name is Derpadubber. Yo, the teddy bear is dead. Oh, teddy bear, I hardly knew thee. Um, yeah, my girlfriend's name is Derpadubber. And Kali, you've got a name in this as well. Your name is in here, for sure. I didn't put it as my favorite food or my favorite thing. Um, but it's here. It's in it. And I think you'll enjoy it. I think it's, I think it's a character you like. Because who doesn't like this character? He's so good. All right, sizing up the situation. I'll just tell you, you got poo. <laughs> Kali is poo. Poo is Kali. Real Steven PSW with the cheese entrance. Hello, hello. Um, so right now, we're just working on leveling up Derp. Offense up by three, nice. Guts up three, really nice. She learned Thunder, which is not great. I figured you'd like poo. I figured you'd like poo, Kali. Zeke is Jeff. Um... So, yeah, it'll be a while before we see Kali. Um, it's, it's quite some time before you get to see, see that character, but, uh, but probably within the next several days, we'll get him. Because I'll be playing this daily. Um, yeah. Yeah, I'll be playing this daily for probably a couple of weeks uh, before we finish it. Because I'm playing very, very casual. I'm not worried about speed. I'm not worried about, you know, finding everything necessarily. Um, just wanna, just wanna play the game, cause it's a great game, man. It's so good. And it, it makes me really happy to play it. The game just puts smile on my face, um, all the time. There's one section that I just hate. Kali, you'll know. It's the, uh, there wasn't enough characters available for you, Steven PSW. Sorry about that. Um, IQ up one, HP up two, PP up three. Yeah, Paula's HP goes up so slowly. So yeah, this is the entrance to the cave. We're still in this town. I will gladly remove my entire being for the playthrough. Nice. Nice. Um, I think... I think we're probably fine to just get stay in here and grind a little bit. Um, you know what? We've got a lot of room. So... Oh, the food stand went out of business. No! I wanted egg. Oh, Pokey stole all the food. What a son of a bitch. Oh, Pokey, we're gonna get you. We are gonna get you. All right. Um, we can get some snacks here, though. Refreshing herb. Does that heal? Does that... Oh, only one hour before Nintendo Direct. Nice. Nice. Refreshing herb is a... Um... A revive item, right? But it doesn't... Can you, like... Is it select button? Mm. I would like another croissant. Yeah. It doesn't really tell you what any of the items do. <laughs> Which is, again, a bit of a throwback. I kind of like that. Um, yeah, we're just going to pop back in here. We're going to do a little bit of grinding because we have to level Paula up. Uh, we've got to get her to the point where we can fight the boss in here. Just so we can deal with that now, and we'll never have to come back and, and do it later. Um, but, uh, nice thing about this game is that you can, um, you can just skip this for now, and come back and do it later when you've got a full party and it's super easy. So, it's an option, but we're not gonna take that option. We're gonna win. We're gonna battle and we're gonna win. Alright. The enemy left a present. A croissant. And Schmur leveled up. Offense 2, defense 2. That's awesome. Um, 1, 1, 1. Max HP up 11 and PP 5. That's pretty good. It heals strangeness and crying. Thank you, Kali. 
<laughs> That's so funny. What does the refreshing herb do? Oh, it, it cures strangeness and crying. It cures your crying. It's just great, man. It's so good. It's so good. All right. Derp level? No. Okay. Well... Um, we can at least start kind of moving through this place. We'll probably run into a butterfly at some point, which means we can heal up and, and keep our, our pee-pee. Um, the mole playing rough is being absent-minded. So good. So good. There we go. Level 10. Offense 1, speed 1, IQ 1. Yeah, the small amount of HP that she gets is just so bad. Hey, look, it's a present. And it's a bear! There's a croissant! Dude, this cave is full of croissant. This, we'll call it croissant cave. Forever and ever, amen. Um, go derp! Go schmer! Oh, she took a hit. Oh, yo, derp! Not happy about that. Big fan of the random direction shrooms. Oh my god. You missed the one time it's happened. Well, it happened twice, but I died in the fight, so we didn't get to experience it so much that time. Um, but man, pain in the ass, dude. I love that the game rewards you for taking, for going to a hospital and taking, and getting it removed. That was such a smart move to give you money for dealing with that because it's so annoying. It's so good, though. Um, we went back to the beginning. We gotta figure out how to get around in here. The single moles playing rough are not, uh, are not sustaining us right now. Okay, Schmer's all right, everybody. Schmer can handle it. He's a big, tough boy. He's a big, strong man. Okay. Um, I love the way that combat works in this game. I love how it's, um... How you can avoid it if you're good. It's difficult to completely avoid, though. Like, it's just, it's so well done. And that eventually, look at this. We got the drop on it. Um, how eventually so many of the fights you don't even need to worry about. Um, because you'll just auto-kill and get the free experience. It's awesome. Best status ailments you've ever witnessed. Yeah, I like it as a status ailment. Why is the higher grass black? Higher grass? HP up six, okay. And she learned PK Freeze Beta. It's good stuff. Um, I want, I want presents. <laughs> I don't want to fight bats though. We have to walk out of here anyway, so. All right, single mole. I don't know what grass you're talking about. Why is the higher, higher grass black? Sorry, I misread. I thought you said higher grass, and now it makes complete and total sense. We're just going to run past that bear. We'll probably run past this bear, too. The dungeon border. Yeah, it could be. The... Yeah, they, we're in a cave, though. There's not any grass in here, from what I can tell. Doo, doo, doo. Hey, it's a butterfly. All right. So we're going to kill this bear, and then we'll heal up and get the butterfly. Hopefully Paula will live. Uh, we might heal her before this fight, actually. Before the bear fight. Okay, let's use life up on derp and fight this bear. We did it. We got the drop on him. So good. Whap him. Whap him for reals. Mighty bear. 25 damage. Serious. Pretty serious, but Derp took care of him. And we gained 300 experience. Not great, but pretty good. All right, let's use life up on Schmur. And then we'll grab this butterfly. Get back here, butterfly. All right. Get our pee-pee back. 
butterfly refills your pee-pee. If you didn't know. Um, and I think we gotta get up there. I don't want to fight the bear if I can help it, but I can't help it. Small amount. Yeah, her magic is absolutely OP. Um, she is definitely the, the best damage dealer. I don't know, well... Ness is probably a slightly better damage dealer, but not super significantly. Um, and Paul is more consistent. Offense up three, defense two, awesome. IQ three, good stuff. HP three, and PP 13, yes. Yes, yes, yes. Give me that sweet PP. Oh, a bear and a mole, you say. Well... Whatever will we do? PP cost six. Um, we're gonna use freeze on the bear. Should be good damage. Yeah, yeah, very good damage. All right, we saved ourselves from the bear. Um, so we don't have to take any of his big damage attacks. And the mole playing rough is going down. An evil looking bear, I know. The enemies in this are so cute. I remember the first time I fought a caveman in this. Also, for those of you who don't know, I've got Mr. Saturn tattooed right here on my chest slash shoulder. Yo, how did we let that happen? All right, it's just a mole though, we're fine. As long as the bats aren't here, we're good. Uh, and there will be dancing, I announced. I announced that there will be dancing. At least dancing in my chair over the course of this game. Let's go. Give me that XP. All right. Mr. Batty. Dude, is the, the bat is covering up its eyes. I always thought that that was its eyes, but it looks like its claws are like doing this. That's so cute. That's so cute. All right. I'll fight this bear. <laughs> I shouldn't have fought the bear. I should have gone back to the left and, and up because there's some, some, there's a present up there. 59 damage. Oh my goodness. Dude, the damage is serious. Okay. We're going to have to heal a little bit. And that is okay. Offense up three, nice. HP 15 and life up beta. Paula, Derp got one HP and that is all on that level up. That's so bad. Yeah, that bear was not messing around, dude. Not at all. We're gonna hit it with, with uh, Paula's freeze attack. Although with many enemies, I'm gonna use PK Ganja here, and you're gonna use Freeze on the bear still. All right. Yes, we froze it. That's awesome. So we prevented the bear's attack by using an ice attack on it. And now, okay, I'll take that. I'll take that. Uh, derp, with, with some damage, unfortunate. But now we're good. Fish better have my honey. <laughs> Love it. Love it. Oh, bear time. All right. Oh, we could have just kept going. Oh, a Psy Caramel. That's awesome. Okay. Um, Shmur, I'd like you to give... I'd like you to use the croissant on Derp. Thank you. All right, Derp's HP are maxed out. PK Ganja is the best attack. That's right. That's right. Oh, of course. Of course she immediately took damage. Come on, moles. Why you gotta do me like that? All right, they missed. That's good. All right, we tamed one of them. Dead. Let's get Derp another level, please. Crubs. Crubs, I said. 
You heard it. You heard it right. Crubs. No. All right, we're okay. We're okay. Just another double mole. So we'll take a quick heal here, and uh, and then we'll see if we can deal with this boss. I think we'll probably be okay. Yeah, we need more of the walking base trap tracks, exactly. We sell to a customer called PKUSA, and now I'll only think of this game. Awesome. Awesome. All right, I'm going to use items to heal because this way Schmur can use um, PK Ganja four times. So, Schmur, enjoy yourself a croissant. And uh, Derp, enjoy... Enjoy yourself a bread roll. Yeah, that's good. And what's my status look like? Out of 180. I don't think that's worth a croissant. Let's do it. All right. This is the second your sanctuary, but it's mine now. Take it from me if you dare. Okay. <laughs> I'll do what I can. It's Mondo Mole. All right. PK Ganja. And uh, Freeze Beta. It only did 17? That doesn't seem right. That doesn't seem right. PK Ganja. What do I use on this guy? Is it fire that I use? I guess it is. Okay. PK Ganja again and fire again. Yo. All right, we're going to use our last one for a nice big heal with life up. Um, and we can only use one anyway, so let's use beta. And Derp should not have attacked. She should have used fire. Okay. Uh, I also should have given Paula the bomb, probably, so she could use that. Okay. Boom. Oh no, derp. She's dead. <laughs> I didn't get to her fast enough. Um, oh, my phone is a ringing. That's weird. Let's go. Uh, bash. No, let's use the bomb. Dude, Mondo Mole. Yes! Yes! That's huge. Now, it sucks that, that Derp doesn't get any experience for this fight. Um, but Shmur is now level 21 with a terrible level. <laughs> a terrible level. Oh, phone's ringing, dude. Hello, it's your dad. You've been out there for a long time now. Maybe none of my business. That's not his voice. Maybe none of my business. But don't you think it would be a good idea if you took a break? Um, no, no. Oh, I see. Well, it doesn't make me happy, but I understand the point about the fate of the world being at stake. Click beep. Click beep. Yeah, that crit was lucky. Okay, second your sanctuary location discovered. And we feel good and happy and joyful. And we get this beautiful music. Beautiful music. Shmur briefly had a vision of a baby in a red cap. Shmur's soundstone recorded the melody of the lily footsteps. All right, can I use my exit mouse? Yes, let's go. Okay, to the hospital. <laughs> we actually, oh, Paul is okay. We got a full party heal. Oh, that's very nice. That's very nice of them to do that. Very kind. Okay. No need to go to the hospital. We can just go straight back to town. And we never have to come back to Happy Happy Valley again. Um, which, I mean, I don't hate this place. But uh, but now that the cult's not here, the, the magic has faded. 
you know? The magic has faded. Um, so let's go back through the valley. Um, and hopefully get Paula a little bit more XP. Uh, I gotta remember how to get out of here, though. I keep saying Paula when I should be saying derp, I know. Um, is the bridge fixed? Maybe the bridge is fixed by now. I know there's a bridge down here. Well, that was lucky we didn't get, um... We didn't get sneak attacked there. All right. Wap, wap. Brain shock. It did not work on Shmur. Boop, boop. <laughs> All right. He burst into flames. He does tons of damage. But we're okay. Mr. Saturn Town is always worth a visit. Saturn Valley, for sure. Derp's level is now 14. Speed 1, HP 1, PP 1. Terrible levels. Terrible levels. All right, let's keep Derp alive. Keep my Derp alive. Oh, keep my Derp alive. All right. Um, yeah, this bridge, this bridge is fixed. And look who did it. Blue, blue. Oops, I won't say it again. I fixed the bridge as a sign of apology. I'm just trying to help. Thanks, man. Helpful dude. A helpful and friendly dude. Okay. Plants. Saturn Valley has a terrible neighbor. That's right. The, the waterfall of time. <laughs> the waterfall of time is the terrible neighbor of Saturn Valley. Um, we'll get there. Won't be too, too long before we get there. We got a croissant. We're just, we're croissant rich right now. My dog is looking at me like, why do you keep saying that word? What the heck are you talking about, Durgles? <laughs> I'm sorry, Durgles. I didn't mean to accuse you. To j'accuse you. I did get a text, Zeke. Thank you for letting me know. It's actually a voicemail. Um, stage manager of the show I'm working on called me. I'm glad he left a message. Um, I don't know what message he could be leaving, but they don't even have rehearsal tonight, so it can't be that urgent. I don't think it's a problem. All right, get this freaking mushroom out of here. Thank you. I do not want to get mushed. Whap. Oh, an exciting thing is about to happen. Yeah. <laughs> Yep, the beeps. That, uh, the Final Fantasy victory theme that you may have heard earlier was my ringtone as well. Beep, 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 Dude. Inaccessible butterfly. Inaccessible butterfly. What rudeness. All right, so we're going to go to, uh, Polecat. Polecat? Polestar. Um... We also want to do this. Do we how we have $41? How much does it cost? What kind of phone do I use? I just got real Steven PSW. Um How do I How do I get a ticket? For now I'm resting. Life is long. Take it easy, chubs. You don't have a town map. You didn't borrow one from Audit Library. <laughs> Take it easy, chubs. <laughs> <laughs> um, I just got an iPhone XR. Um, like, just a few days ago, actually. Um, so that's pretty cool. I like it. I like it a lot. It's good. I had an iPhone 6 up till then. Yeah, we talked about this. We talked about this. All right. It looks like the next bus will come pretty soon. So we have to do this. Um, bus to three, but I'm not sure if we can get there or not. Fares $4. Yep. Uh, yeah, we've got to do this at some point before we advance. So we might as well do it now and see it, because it's fun. And we get great music. Oh, it's so good. How did I get a custom ringtone on it? Well, I made the ringtone, but you can actually download it as well. You can purchase it. Um, and then I just put it in my ringtones through iTunes. It's very easy. Oh no, g -g 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 ghosts. Spooky ghosts, ghosts of the spooky variety. Not friendly ghosts like Casper. Crazy music happens and we come back out the way we came in. For some reason, the bus returned to Tucson. 
Yep, just like I thought. Okay, I'm starting to get the creeps. We're going back to the bus station. You want to get off here? No. Take me back to the bus station. Go faster. Thank you. Such good music, man. I love it. Yeah, about to be the best guys in the game. So good. All right, back to Polestar. That's why I said Polecat, because there's a cat sitting on top. Hey, everybody, I brought Paula back. Yahoo, I knew it. You saved Derp. I don't understand it, but I know that Derp's miraculous power and your great courage will allow you to stand up to any challenge. Derp, if you must take a trip, be sure to bring this along. It's my very own handmade band-aid. Handmade band-aid. <laughs> Double tap thunderclap. I know, I'll call it a hand-aid. Schmur got the hand-aid. Did you meet Dad? He's sorry that he suspected Mr. Everdread at Berglund Park. Okay. What is this hand-aid? What does the hand-aid do? I don't remember at all. Oh, derp! Schmur, thank you so much. You must be the boy who will save the world like in Derp's dream. Derp, I'm sure you'd be a big help to Schmur. It's not every day a father lets his daughter embark on a journey to save the world. Dad, don't worry about me. Schmur and I will be able to take care of ourselves. In three, the next town will meet another friend. If the three of us can combine our power, no one can beat us. Now wipe your eyes, blow your nose, and smile before we take off. Goodbye, Derp. Don't worry. I won't cry anymore. <laughs> All right, Mr. Everdread. Does he suck? I thought he ended up being kind of a nice guy. Yo, everybody has a piece. Hello, Schmer. Everdread's looking for you. He's got something for you. I'm out of here. <laughs> All right, let's go to Everdread then. Um, so one of the things, one of the only things I... One of the few things that is a big negative of this game for me is the bicycle. That you get the bicycle. They should have given you the bicycle in the first town, first of all. Um, because by the time you get it here, you spend so little time with it. Um, and then when you get your next party member, you can't use it anymore. Um, the bicycle is kind of a pointless item. I was gonna ask you to be my partner, but I know you'll refuse. It's written all over your face. If you accept it, I was gonna give you some money. Actually, I can't keep the money now anyway. Let me give this to you, it's $10,000. Here's the money any way you like. Can't refuse my generosity, just accept it. Now I'll plan on looking for the evil Monty Monty statue that liar exaggerate unearthed and on it. See you at another time in another space. Thanks, Everdread. Schmur got the wad of bills. Oh yeah. Hand aid restores to full HP. Okay. Can you get more? Or is that the only hand aid in the game? Is Would everybody at Polestar give me something? I don't know. I doubt it. I, I have my doubts. Um, good. Fine. To the theater! Wait. I guess I lost my ticket, so now I can't get in. Ticket counter at the department store was even sold out. Please present your ticket. I have no ticket. You want to see Poochie Fudd, the manager? Poochie Fudd? I don't remember that at all. Right through this door, please. All right, Poochie Fudd. Uh, he looks like a Poochie Fudd, though. He definitely does. The Runaway Five owe me a lot of money. They'll stay here until they pay me back. They might be here for a hundred years, unless you decide to pay off their debt. Ha ha ha. Pardon? You want to talk about money? How about later after the show, even if we're talking big bucks? I've got definite rules about how I handle my money matters. So I was going to pay off their their uh, their debt, but I guess I got to talk to them first. Hey, you came with Derp! Then you deserve a present, playboy. Here's a backstage pass. You can get into our shows with this. Schmur got the backstage pass. You're with a girl today. You must be pretty popular. How about introducing her to my bandmate? He's right there. Fuzzy Pickles time. 
<laughs> yes, let's freaking go. Okay, pictures, take it instantaneously. I'm a photographic genius if I do say so myself. Okay, get ready for an instant memory. Look at the camera. Ready, say fuzzy pickles. Fuzzy pickles. So good. Wow, what a great photograph. It'll always bring back the fondest of memories. His voice changed, I know. You're gonna stick around long enough for the concert. Perfect. Perfect, it won't be long. It won't be long at all. All right. Backstage pass, here we go. Here you go, hurry, you're just in time to see the Runaway 5 show. Look at this. Ugh. Oh. Ugh. Oh. Now, I could talk to these people. Lucky the Runaway 5 told me I could go backstage, but I don't have a pass. I'm sure security will stop me. Hey, really, you have a pass? I can't believe it. Can you take me with you, please, please, please? I compose is your sister. Yes, this rocks. Let's go. Ooh, my heart is pounding. Talk to the right one immediately. Hey, boys. Boom, 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 boom. I'm so excited. I might just wet myself. My heart is going pitter patter. Hey, you get to see our show, you lucky kid. I hope you pay attention. I want some bread. I need the coinage. I want more dough all the time. I wrote the lyrics to most of the Runaway 5 songs. Money, that's what I want. Money, that's what is hat. Money, that's what I want. Money, it's what we ain't got. Said freedom, freedom, freedom is what we really sought. That's exactly what it sounds like. You cannot tell me otherwise. You just got Mother 2 yesterday and you love it. The Dark Widow 64, I'm glad you love it, man. It's a great game, welcome. Welcome to Channel Schmirkenabur, where we're just casually playing through Earthbound because it's a game that we adore and, uh, and we just want to play it. Shabba doo wop diddly dee da. Shabba doo be bop wah. I got these debt blues. Mm -mm -mm. If I had ten thousand dollars, I could pay off my debts and move on to the next town. I wonder if a bus still runs. It may be rusted out. I don't know if he was singing there or not, but well, yeah. In the old days, there was lots of dancers and acts at this theater. Except now, we're the only act playing here. We even gone into debt here, so we're pretty near stuck. Yuck yuck yuck. Folks at Tout of Tucson will enjoy the Runaway 5 show for quite a few years. Looks like to me. All right. I have a lot of bills. No, I don't want to give. I want to use. Don't try to use your play money here, kid. Oh my gosh. That's not real money, is it? Wow. It is real money. All right, let's play the show. Oh, baby. It's concert time, ladies and gentlemen. Sit back and relax and enjoy the dulcet tones of the Runaway Five. Let's go. Tonight, you got the Chaos Theater Soul Men coming at ya. Rockin' and rollin' live on this here stage for a limited time only. The world's greatest bluesman, the Runaway Five. Oh yeah, baby. Concert time. Concert time. I'm gonna turn the volume up for this. Boom, boom, boom. Oh yeah, let's freaking go, dude. Look at them dancing, man. They're so in sync. It's like they've been doing this for years. So good. Runaway 5, I see 6. Ah, real Steven PSW gets it. I feel you're the first friend that I have ever had. The Dark Widow 64, thanks for the follow, man. You're the first friend I ever had. Much appreciated. Much appreciated. This is art. <laughs> okay. We did it. We did it. We watched the concert. And we're going to set the Runaway 5 free next time on Earthbound. Thanks for tuning in, everybody. Twitch folks, stick around. We got one more episode. YouTube folks, thanks for tuning in. You know I appreciate it. If you enjoyed the video, hit that like button, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you later. I'll see you around. I'll see you next time. I can't wait to play more Earthbound, and I can't wait to do it with you. Have a great day. Bye.